As you drive up the west side at 19th Street, you see a mural on the side of a building. Since 1970, it's adorned to the side of a medium security women's prison. The artist, his name prominently at the bottom, is Knox Martin. And I put it together and I thought I'd call it Venus. Uh, which was like for the women that was in this building. It rises 12 stories tall and was repainted nine years ago. But very soon, the site will be gone, not torn down, but totally obscured. On the lot next door, work has already begun on a 20-story condo tower. It's like uh, some kind of small death. It's like taking something away from you. It's something that you love. Martin teaches at the Art Students League of New York. This is the blue you were using. The school's director says the mural conveys an artistic statement about color, light, and form. Ira Goldberg. Oh, it's better than good. It's, uh, it's very powerful. But neither the mural or the building it's on have landmark status, so the condo developer, Cape Advisors, will proceed. The developer did not return our calls, and some people who glance at the mural every day seem unmoved by its loss. So, like century-old ads painted on buildings and covered by new construction, this Knox Martin original will be hidden from sight, and the area will lose a piece of outdoor art that's been a vibrant part of Chelsea. John Slattery, CBS 2 News.